Hello everybody, Jimmy is Promo here back again with another awesome video. And in today's video, we will be talking about how you're able to unlock your Galaxy Note 9 by a simple press of the button on the S Pen. Now, before we get started, if you're brand new here at Jimmy's Promo, make sure you guys hit on that subscribe button as well as hit that bell for notifications so you don't miss future videos for the Samsung Galaxy Note 9. So as you may know by now, the brand new S Pen for the Galaxy Note 9 does serve as two main primary functions. The first one being the normal everyday usage of being a S Pen, as well as the brand new equipped Bluetooth functions. Now, if you watched my previous video talking about the full complete guide of the S Pen for the Galaxy Note 9, you might have seen a brand new feature, which is referred to as S Pen Unlock. Now that one is located underneath the advanced features and inside of S Pen. And here it is right over here called S Pen Unlock. So S Pen Unlock is just a simple way of unlocking your phone by pressing the button of the S Pen. Now it's talking about a simple press, not a press and hold. If you do a press and hold of the button of the S Pen, it will launch the application you have set up for it. Now out of the box, this one's actually set up with the camera. And it's a simple way of taking selfies or taking a picture of your entire family. So right out of the box, if you do a simple press and hold, of that little S Pen button, it will launch the camera. A double press will actually change the camera orientation and then hitting the button once will take the picture. Now heading back over into the S Pen Unlock, it does state down here that it will only work if you're using your S Pen before the phone locks and the S Pen is still connected to your phone. Now when you choose the option right here for Use S Pen Unlock, it will ask for your credential of whatever you're using for the lock screen for this device and then you'll hit on OK. Now what it basically means by staying connected and that the S Pen is being in use is that there's a little icon on the very top of the phone showing a Bluetooth icon along with an S Pen. So if you see that this one right here is actually lit up blue, that means it's activated and also what it means by using the the s pen is that it's actually outside of the phone and not inserted so you don't have to literally be using the s pen as your screen times out or if you hit on this little power button or anything else it's just a way that as long as this s pen is out of the device when you hit on that s pen button it will unlock your phone now what it's talking about with it being in use again as example let's say that the s pen is actually inserted into the phone and then either the screen times out or you hit on your power button. Let's state that you now take out that S Pen. Um, from here, it will not unlock your phone. Even if you do a press and hold, especially inside of this um, always on display, we're able to do a screen off memo. Now, if you were out of this one and it went to this lock screen here, if you hit the button again one more time, it will not unlock. But if you do a press and hold of the button, it wants you to unlock the phone so you're able to actually use its function that was set up for the press and hold, which is the camera. So at the end of the day, this will definitely help out anybody who takes a lot of notes or who uses the S Pen all the time, but you don't have a lot of confidential information or secretive or private stuff that's on your phone, such as pictures or text messages or websites or anything like that. It's kind of a way that maybe if your display was set to timeout at one minute, maybe you walked away, maybe you're checking something maybe food in the oven, maybe something is in the microwave, maybe you have to help somebody out, maybe you had to go to the bathroom. No matter the scenario, let's say that your screen timed out, you went right back over to your device, you wanted to finish what you're doing, uh, but you're kind of busy and you don't really want to touch your phone to unlock the device, you're able to simply do it with a press of the button. So with that stated, if you are somebody who is very conscious about what is on your phone, something being private or confidential, or you don't trust anybody around you, this might not be the best feature for you to turn on. But if it really doesn't matter, Matter. If somebody gets into your phone, maybe you might like it because maybe your son or daughter wants to get back into your phone because they just wanted to basically press a button on the S Pen to go back into Pen Up because maybe they wanted to finish their drawing or coloring that they're working on. This might work out for you. So I hope that you guys have liked this video. If you guys did, please give this thing a huge thumbs up. And again, if you have not subscribed and you're brand new to this channel, you can hit on this circle right over here. You can hit on subscribe there. Share this video with your friends and family and social media sites. And outside of that, I'll see you guys later.